I just received my shipment for the 70My dash cam 4K A810. It's the latest model from 70My. Yeah, it's a successor for the A800 series. So I ordered it through AliExpress from the 70My official uh, store. Let's do a quick unboxing and see what comes inside the box. So you have a user manual and some stickers inside this you have the actual dash cam itself with all the stickers brand new the on off button description of the camera memory card slot the USB C charging slot and the connection for the rear camera so you can see the size is almost like my palm inside you have you have the tool to do the to hide the wiring behind the we have the connection wire, the charging connection wire from the dash cam to your cigarette lighting. Then you have the connector to the cigarette lighting port. This is specific for the 70mm and this you can use for any other charging. There's nothing else inside the box, so that's what's inside the box. The instruction manual has the electrostatic sticker which shows the instruction uh, installation procedure as well and the user manual has descriptions of how to install your dash cam and the different buttons the purpose of the different buttons how to mount the dash cam and all this it's in all the languages so that's pretty much inside the box along with the dash cam i ordered the rear camera it has to be ordered separately for rear coverage this is the specification it's production from july 2023 let's see what's inside the box there's a user manual inside so the box pretty much contains the rear camera with its wiring so that's the rear camera with the wiring this will be connected to the main dash cam the dash cam has the feature for 24 hour surveillance, parking monitoring and uh, time lapse recording but for this you need to order this extra hardware kit which will connect the dash cam directly onto the car's battery and the fuse box. So what happens is when the, the dash cam does not have the power from the cigarette lighting port, it will take the power from the battery on the car switched off and it will give you 24 hour surveillance during the parking. Let's see what's inside the box. So this is the wiring kit. So one end of this will be connected to the power of the dash cam, that is a USB-C. You can see the USB-C will be connected to the power of the dash cam and this three wiring will go into the fuse box to the respective ports. Then you get a parking surveillance and time lapse recording.